yeah you know if you think about digital currency digital currency has to be a form of electronic cash rather than a form of electronic money that lives in bank accounts and things so if it's a form of electronic cash that has a really key and obvious implication which is that it has to work person to person digital currency has to be able to work offline so if the mobile network is down or the power is out I should still be able to go around the store and 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 buy a pint of milk or something so yeah I think that's one of the really important implications of building this this parallel infrastructure for digital currency you know rather than just sort of layering something on top of the existing electronic money systems